<laughs> yeah, man, I do it for the fam. Tryna put food on my table, going ham. PYT says she knows who I am. Browse on fleek, she'll do it for the gram. Hey, what's going on, guys? So, in the last video I made, um, I had a comment saying that you couldn't really hear me properly, so I've hopefully turned up my mic a bit and you can, you know, hear me properly. So, in this tutorial, we're going to be learning how to make a simple Skype resolver. Um, now, I'm going to link a uh, website in the description and it'll have loads of APIs on and um, you can you know mess around with all the um, APIs and all that and you can make other stuff from a, from a resolver you can make like geolocation stuff like that so anyway into the video I'm gonna go ahead and open up Visual Studios and create a new project it doesn't really matter what the name is um, you can obviously name yours if you're gonna make a like massive Skype tool or whatever so first of all you want to go to your toolbox if your toolbox is not showing up you want to go to view and then it'll be like in the middle um, and then you want to press uh, you want to search for text box right here really simple text box and then we want a button um, nothing fancy maybe, we'll maybe just line this up a bit and then um, you don't have to have another text box but I'm just gonna have a another text box to show the result of the IP so I'm just gonna um, resolve and then username I cannot type today alright so after you've done whatever you want to do you double click on your button and um, you go up to the top where it's got all these uh, using and then you want to type in using system.net and then you want to come down to where your uh, button underscore click is and then you want to type in web client and you can call it whatever you want I'm just going to call it squirt equals new web client and then you just want to end it off there and then you want to create a string and then you can call this whatever you want, I'm just going to call it IP and then you want to um, have your web client and then dot download string and this is where your API will come in um, like I said I'm going to link a website in the description um, so I'm just going to go onto the website, it's called api.predator.whatthefuck or WTF or whatever um, so, <clears throat> excuse me, so on the first on the first row, um, Skype Resolver attempts to blah 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 blah. You want to highlight up to the equal sign because um, obviously we don't want to uh, resolve Stefan dot Thorn. Um, so you want to paste that API in there up to arguments equals, and then outside of the um, I always forget what those fucking things are called. Outside of those little uh, like quotation mark things, you want to type plus text box oh shit if I can type I can't even type today text box one dot text okay so that's going to download the string that's going to resolve what's ever in the text box and then we need to um, you know put the result into the second text box so what we're going to do is um, we're going to type text box two which is the box underneath it now if you don't have uh, two text boxes you just put text box one alright so depending on how many text boxes you have put text box one dot text or text box two dot text um, and then you put equals IP end it off and there you go bish bash bosh um, so I'm just gonna start it up uh, make sure it works whoops um, put this into my mouse screen and I will get someone from my Skype um, some poor kid and then I'm just gonna resolve him make sure it works so there you go sorry dangle cam um, so yeah obviously it works um, you can do this with you know geolocating you know have fun with it do whatever you want um, that's pretty much the end of the tutorial and peace